more news coming in. The Kuwait police has arrested a suspected ISIS financer by the name of Abdullah Hadi for supporting financing Indian ISIS recruits, including Arib Majid and three others. Kuwait has informed the NIA of the arrest. The NIA is likely to send a team to Kuwait for interrogation. Abdullah allegedly gave 1,000 US dollars to Indian ISIS recruits. It's first foreign national to be arrested in the Indian ISIS case. We have Kamal on the phone line with us. Uh, Kamalji, when is the NIA team likely to travel to Kuwait? Uh, well, this is going to happen uh, slightly later. Uh, but remember, uh, one of the biggest things is a shot in the arm for the NIA. This is the first foreign national to be arrested in this particular case. Uh, remember, this is the case of Arib Majid. Uh, the three others who had actually disappeared, uh, some of them who had actually reappeared in a video uh, which, was, uh, which had warning for India. Uh, but definitely, uh, remember the Mutual Legal Assistance Treaty, something which has been sent to almost 11 nations, including the United States, China, Australia, Turkey. One of them was also sent to, uh, to, to Kuwait and in this uh, they mentioned about Abdullah Hadi and remember he is a man who is actually financed and also helped these terrorists uh, to move to Syria. Uh, they fell short of $1,000 and through that an Afghan national who was in touch with them uh, promised that $1,000 would reach them and that's where Abdullah Hadi came handy. Uh, right. He not only provided them assistance but also gave them money. Now remember, uh, as far as uh, mutual legal assistance treaty is concerned, uh, this arrest has been made. The NI has been uh, informed of the arrest. Right. Uh, it's in likely in some time uh, that the team would actually leave. But remember, uh, this is obviously a big shot in the arm in as far as global terrorism is concerned. Right. Uh, first foreign national to be arrested in the case. Kamalji, thanks so much for that update. First foreign national to be arrested uh, in the case of an alleged Indian ISIS uh, with an Indian ISIS angle. Kamal, we're going to keep coming back to you for more updates.